Hey y'all, welcome back to our channel. As you guys see from the title today, we're about to get into some pan seared salmon, okay? You guys, this salmon was absolutely delicious, so of course I had to share this recipe with you all. Today was not even a day that I was going to film a video. I was actually doing some meal prep, and it was just starting to look real good, so I'm like, let me go ahead and film and share this recipe. If you are new here, thank you so much for stopping by. Please feel free to like, subscribe, and leave us a comment if you've enjoyed the content. To all of our new and returning subscribers, thank you, thank you, thank you. We love and appreciate you all for coming back to our channel each and every time. There are multiple salmon recipes on our channel. We have a stuffed Italian salmon. We have a mango salsa salmon. We actually have a salmon patty video that's made out of fresh salmon. You know, when you put the cheese, the onion, the bell pepper, season it real good. Coat it with a good coating and fry them up. Yep, we have a salmon patty recipe on our channel that is made with fresh salmon. And I'm gonna do a few more, okay? So if you love salmon, you've come to the right place. And today we're just gonna go ahead and make a sweet chili butter sauce salmon recipe. I'm gonna also add some zucchini noodles with it, some other veggies that I'm prepping here for my meal prep week. And then of course we have our absolutely beautiful fresh salmon fillets, okay? So we're gonna go ahead and just get our sauce made up of this butter parsley and then we're gonna add in our sweet chili sauce. You wanna brown your butter? That's what really, really brings out its flavor. Do not burn it, but once you see it turning brown, then you can go ahead and pour your sweet chili sauce in so that all of those flavors can be rich and savory, all right? We're also gonna add some raw organic honey here. You guys saw that bottle at the beginning of the video. You can add regular honey. We just want the honey for the added sweetness and that squeeze of lemon. It always brings that fresh, lemony citrusy taste the honey the lemon and the heat together bomb okay so we're gonna go ahead and season our salmon with garlic powder onion powder and table blend mrs dash we're gonna just make sure that all the seasonings are rubbed into that meat for even distribution. All right, you guys, so there is our fish and we're placing it into our skillet. During this process, I decided that I wanted to cut these fillets in half, so I did that before they started to cook for too long. Again, you guys, you probably wanna do this before you put your meat in the skillet, depending on the desired size that you like your salmon to be. I always start it off at about a medium to high temperature so I can get that nice char on my outer edges, and then I continue to cook it slowly because I like my salmon to be tender, but I like to have a really, really nice crust on the outer edges of it. So I started off at a medium high temperature, sear both sides, and then I cook it slowly for about another five to six minutes. The worst thing you can do when it comes to salmon is to overcook it and it'll be dry, okay? So when you turn that temperature down to cook it for the extra time, that allows it to cook slowly and not to overcook. So I said all of that to say, <laughs> Two minutes on each side at a medium high heat and then once you do both sides and get that nice char that you want, go ahead and turn your heat down to about a low to medium temperature and let it cook slowly for about five to six minutes on each side.
tried to get some up close shots for you guys. It was so tender, so juicy, so delicious. It was sweet and savory. It was just everything. Like, I love this sauce on this salmon. I actually did a video a few weeks back with this same sauce. And I did it with baked orange roughy. That was delicious as well. And I put it on top of my veggies. So everyone in my house loved it. So I decided to go ahead and make it again, okay? Here are my zucchini noodles that I added in with our salmon. I seasoned them with the same exact seasonings, garlic powder, onion powder, and the table blend. It was just a really healthy, delicious choice, okay? It was bomb. I felt like I was eating a very savory pasta, a very hearty pasta, okay? So that is it for this video. I hope that you guys have enjoyed. Again, check out our other salmon recipes on our channel if you've enjoyed this one here. To all of our new and returning subscribers, thank you, thank you, thank you for coming back to our channel each and every time. We love and appreciate you all. Go ahead and check out our What's For Dinner playlist as well if you haven't. It is full of so many bomb recipes from breakfast to lunch to dinner to desserts. And I'm adding new ones almost every other day. Thank you guys once again for stopping by. And y'all already know, we will see you all in our next video. Oh, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and share the information of our channel with any and everyone you know. All right, y'all. See y'all in the next one. My life wasn't perfect, yeah, I know that now When it came crashing down All I know is that I need you around When it comes crashing down All I need is not to feel so much alone So step inside my zone Baby, you can give me everything I want Everything I want Always dance and sing You're captivating me All I need is to know that I'm in your heart And never be apart All I need is not to feel so much alone So step inside my zone Baby, I can give you everything you want Everything you want Take me to your paradise